published July 1, 2022. 1. Capstone, which was seen in the news recently, is a satellite launched by which space agency? A. NASA, B. ISA, C. SpaceX, D. Rocosmos. Answer. Correct answer, A. NASA. Notes, NASA has recently launched a 25-kilogram satellite capstone, which is short for CIS Lunar Autonomous Positioning System Technology Operations and Navigation Experiment. The satellite is designed to test a unique and elliptical lunar orbit. Capstone will enter an elongated orbit called a near-rectilinear halo orbit, NRHO. It will provide data about operating in an NRHO and showcase key technologies. 2. In the PSLV C-53 mission, ISRO launched three satellites of which country? A. Nepal, B. Bangladesh, C. Singapore, D. New Zealand. Show answer. Correct answer, C. Singapore. Notes, the Indian Space Research Organization, ISRO, has launched three satellites from Singapore in its polar satellite launch vehicle, PSLV C-53. Mission, it is being launched from the Satish Dhawan Space Center, Sriharikota. PSLV C-53 is also the second dedicated mission of New Space India Limited, NSIL, a corporate arm of the Department of Space. ISRO has successfully launched the PSLV C-52 mission in February 2022 by injecting Earth Observation Satellite, EOS-04. 3. What is the budgetary outlay of Computerization of Primary Agricultural Credit Societies, PACs? A. 216 crore rupees, B. 2516 crore rupees, C. 750 crore rupees, D. 7216 crore rupees. Show answer. Correct answer, B. 2516 crore rupees. Notes, the Cabinet Committee on Economic Affairs chaired by Prime Minister Narendra Modi approved computerization of primary agricultural credit societies, PACs, with a budgetary outlay of 2,516 crore rupees. The objective is to increase efficiency of PACs, bring transparency and accountability in their operations. This project proposes computerization of about 63,000 functional PACs over a period of five years with Government of India share of 1,528 crore rupees. State cooperative banks and district central cooperative banks were already automated by NABAR then brought on common banking software. 4. Which is the venue of the 11th World Urban Forum held in 2022? A. Spain, B. Poland, C. Australia, D. France. Sir. Correct answer, B. Poland. The 11th World Urban Forum was held in Poland. The National Institute of Urban Affairs NIUA, Climate Center for Cities, NIUACQ, World Resources Institute India, WRI India, and their partners launched India's first national coalition platform for urban nature-based solutions, NBS. India Forum for Nature-Based Solutions aims to create a collective of NBS entrepreneurs, government entities and like-minded organizations to aid in scaling urban nature-based solutions. 5. 2022 Resilient Democracy Statement is associated with which global association? A. G20 B. BRICS C. G7 D. ASEAN Correct answer, C. G7 Notes, leaders of the powerful G7 grouping and its five partner countries, including India issued a joint statement titled, 2022 Resilient Democracy Statement, the leaders affirmed that they are committed to open public debate and the free flow of information online and offline while guarding the freedom, independence and diversity of civil society actors.